World Partnership Project is a flagship project of the European Commission under the COSME program of the European Union for the competitiveness of small and medium-sized enterprises. Considered a flagship program, WORTH becomes the only European project where designers, SME manufacturers, and tech providers converge around the development of innovative and design-oriented project ideas that help them remain competitive through the incubation support provided. In the framework of the last year of Europe 2020 agenda, WORTH is proud to present the results of the second round of 62 partnership projects committed to the development of a more smart, sustainable, and inclusive growth through design solutions. Within WORLD, an ecosystem is created where designers and SMEs can work together in solutions covering the key challenges of the European Union, one of them being circular economy and resources efficiency. One in every three participating projects addresses any of the challenges related to the circular economy and resource efficiency. Worth is a believer in a fashion industry that values communities, the environment, creativity and profit in equal measure. When discussing innovation and market potential, the circular economy is rapidly becoming one of the most used terms in the European fashion and lifestyle industries. It provides a guideline for the industry when making investments in production technology, product development, and in respect to the selection of materials. However, designers and the industry still face tough challenges in the transition from a traditional linear production and conception model to a circular one. This is the reason why a circular model is a relevant feature within WORTH. In this way, we can connect resource efficiency, production and elimination of waste, and new commercial opportunities which are valorized when taking some circular design decisions. Recently, we have seen the Global Fashion Agenda 2020 commitment as the first initiative presented, and according to the GAP report, only 9% of our businesses are circular nowadays. Those if we do not act in the design phase to support new and innovative opportunities, the possibility of closing this loop is increasingly reducing. Hi, my name is Marian and I'm the founder of Estonian material technology startup Shellatex Technologies. At Shellatex, we develop a novel, eco-friendly letter-like textile tackle the problem that almost 95% of leather in the world is made using toxic chemicals, there are no eco-friendly alternatives that would be also affordable, easily scalable, to be able to bring them to the masses and make an impact. My partner in World Partnership Project was Anna, who is the founder of Belgium-based Finnish high-end handbags brand Noah. We got to know each other in summer 2018, after Anna learned about Shellatex from World Partnership Project team member. And after having a closer look, Anna found Shellatex material very interesting and similar to something that she had been looking for for a while. An affordable, eco-friendly leather-like textile that comes in rolls and different colors with constant quality. We could say that our collaboration really got started thanks to World Partnership Project. During the project, we developed further Shellatex material to make it more durable, Anna designed the back prototypes at her studio. And finally, we, um, the first prototypes of the small back collection were produced in the atelier in Portugal that Anna works with. Our collaboration was very smooth and we discussed several aspects about the project honestly with each other. Probably having a similar cultural background was helpful a bit as well, since we are both from neighbor countries, Finland and Estonia. I had not been involved with this kind of international collaboration projects before with Shellatex and it was a great experience. I enjoyed working with Anna and learned a lot from her, as well increased the network thanks to Word, which both are very useful for Shellatex 
and also for me personally in the future. Even though sometimes international collaboration projects can be time consuming, next to other business activities, then it is definitely very useful for individual growth, but also for business competitiveness. You can share ideas, contacts, and learn a lot from each other. Collaboration helps you to discover new sites about your product and business, and it opens up new opportunities. New Relation presents the ghost bag. The idea of the handbag was born during our summer holidays at the seaside. We got confronted, like many others, to plastic waste washed up on the shoreline. The waste appeared to us as a revenant, first discarded in the depth of the water, but brought back by the waves. It led us to face the traces of our accidental way of life and revealed the absurdity to think that we don't have to deal with something once it's out of sight. From that experience, we asked ourselves how we can make a bag that is made of recycled materials and will also be recyclable. Therefore, we've developed a new fabric consisting of fishing nets recovered from the sea, also known as ghost nets, trapped in Econil regenerated nylon fabric. In order to test the recyclability of the bag, we partnered up with Polymer Science Park, specialist in recycling. By considering the afterlife of the bag, we wish to reintegrate this object into an evolving cycle, an open loop. The fishing nets are provided by a fisherman cooperation in the Netherlands that work together on the cleanup of the North Sea. The Econil yarns and fabric are made in Italy and the first prototype has been manufactured in a high-end atelier in Paris. Our bag demands the use of artisanal techniques and each bag is unique because of the arbitrary placement of the nets. The bag will be available for pre-order at the end of September 2020. Our world is a beautiful place and it is our task to keep it like that. But currently, our methods of production are not good for the planet because we are depleting raw materials and we are causing environmental damage. So we should embrace each possibility to innovate and create new standards. At Crone.bio, we use nature's intelligence to make products. In fact, we use mycelium, which is the roots of mushrooms. Mycelium has remarkable properties. These properties have evolved during already millions of years before us. And it is this ancient knowledge of the mycelium that allows us to build bridges between nature and technology. With the mycelium, we made our mixture of hemp and mycelium. And after that, we created a shape where we, that we used to fill with the substrate. Then we let the mycelium do the, do the work and grow into a chair during three weeks. At the end of that process, we dried the chair and we had a beautiful shape with one thing missing, which was the upholstery for the chair. La Gadou, who can make a beautiful new textile they call chuk, the upholstery for our chair. During the summer of 2019, we worked together with La Gadou to improve the chair and the upholstery. But even at the end of the summer, we thought it was still at 95% and not 100%. So in November, we got together with, with La Gadou and we gave the chair a radical new design and we called it Lucid. And that was for us the moment that we had our design finished.
Hello everyone, this is me, well something like that, and this is my partner. We have a great project to talk about. But first, a big thank you to the people at The Worth Project for everything they've done. We, we wanted to create the best coat ever seen for the ladies market. And of course, our amazing idea had to involve outdoor, sustainable and technological. And yes, of course, we encountered a few blocks along the way and many challenges. So we had to think through and wear different hats, basically. In order for the garment to be really warm, we found PET, that is recycled, for the insulation. And because we wanted the best for our customers, we put a ski jacket inside. I am Sarmita and I am a conceptual product designer with a particular interest in developing sustainable materials and production techniques. My ongoing project Pineskins is about utilizing those parts of the pine tree that usually are left behind after the tree has been cut. The pine tree is the most common and industrialized tree worldwide but mainly focuses on timber. Therefore other parts are considered byproducts and are either burned or left in the forest. In my project, I collaborate with local tree loggers and harvest bark from pine trees scheduled for cutting. I harvest the bark and soften it with a bio-softening solution to keep the flexibility, color and texture for long periods of time. The harvest and processing of pine skins requires manual work and individual attention. And for those reasons, the price of the bark equals to the highest quality of leather. We created a sustainable design product that puts emphasis on utilizing forest resources thoroughly. A product that is not only unique and unseen, but also surprises with the texture and the scent given naturally by the tree. Worth Partnership Project made me a more mature designer. I went through all phases of creating a project. From concepting, to testing, readjusting, to producing, to readjusting. I could step in the feet of the producer, learn about different techniques and find balance between idea and price. I learned to solve conflicts as well as to find compromises. And I also enjoyed the meetup activities organized by Worth, where I could meet other partnership projects and follow their progress. If I could send a message to other potential collaborations, it would be the following. The project will only go as far as you will push it, so give your best. Collaborations like Worth Partnership Project is a great opportunity for emerging designers to create new products. It's also a great platform to test your product without being scared of making mistakes. You're supported, you're mentored, and you get financial coverage to develop your idea.